Hello everyone. It is Wednesday, January 18th, 2017, and it is New Comic Book Day, and it's very late here in Las Vegas, so this is probably going to be a very quick video. I didn't even put my banner up, but um, I did a video last night on CGC and grading standards, and I promised everybody I would do a New Comic Book video today, so we'll jump right into that right here. Uh, the big book that came out today, at least for me locally here in Las Vegas, was Dan Mendoza's Dollface. Of course, Dan Mendoza. Dan Mendoza does... Uh, Zombie Tramp as well as Vamp Blade. So uh, they had different covers on here. I had a chance to meet up with him today. Uh, we talked a little bit. I had him sign a couple books for me. I'm trying to get him to come to the uh, grand opening of my new location, which he has agreed to do. It's just a matter of getting the actual date as soon as they fix the roof in my place. They're still dragging along. So I haven't been able to set a definitive date on that yet, but it is going to happen. So uh, on with the books. Here's uh, Dollface, number one. That's of course, a signature right there on the bottom. Cover number two. Cover number three. Four. This was the main cover. Sketch variant. As you can tell, I'm a blank sketch variant, excuse me. And the black and white. Now, Mendoza usually does a bunch of different covers for Zombie Tramp. It's usually four covers on the Zombie Tramp storyline. Uh, he did a few extra for Dollface number one. And again, uh, if you haven't got into the Zombie Tramps and the Dollface, Vamp Blade doesn't sell really well, at least here in Las Vegas, but Zombie Tramp sells real well. And I know Dollface was uh, really, people were really looking forward to that book. Uh, if you look at some of the exclusive variants that had come out uh, as he was previewing the book uh, at the Stanley Comic Convention and then at the I believe the Diamond exclusive they did out of Baltimore, uh, I believe it was in September. Those books are in the $100 range because, again, they're so limited and they're hard to find. So if you can find some Dollface, pick it up. Uh, some of the other books I picked up, Venom number three, Teenage Mutant number Turtles number six, The Universe. A storyline I'm liking, Justice League Suicide Squad. I mean, I know they're kind of... You know, jumping on the Suicide Squad bandwagon. This was that was number five. This is number three. It's a six-part series, but they keep coming up with some different covers. Uh, Batman Rebirth number fifteen. I only picked up one cover of that. Uh, Harley Quinn Rebirth number twelve. Cover one. Cover two. Joker not happy kicking the old fire hydrant there. And then uh, I'm a big Xenoscope Grim Fairy Tales fan because I think the cover artwork is really good. That that's a book that you buy because the covers are just amazing sometimes. And here's another one. This was the Diamond Exclusive Limited to 1200. Just a really cool book. I like that. And I had mentioned that the uh, Venom number three had come out today. There's the cover again on that one. Now, if you don't know, if you're a Venom fan, which a lot of people are Venom fan, Carnage fans, in March, they are doing Venom variant covers for all the different titles. And if you haven't seen them, go to bleedingcool.com and look up the Venom variants. And you are going to see some really nice books that are coming out in March. I, I ordered a bunch with uh, one of my shops I buy from. Today we went through and looked at all of them when I, I put orders in. Uh, the Captain America one is got a Statue of Liberty in the background. Really, really nice. There's a Spider-Gwen was really good. There's a Wolverine, an Amazing Spider-Man. Think about the Amazing Spider-Man, though. Most of these are going to be cover price. So you're looking at probably $3.99, $4.99 for these books. But the Amazing Spider-Man, they're going to make $9.99 because it's Amazing Spider-Man. Now, the book does look good, and I'm going to buy one just to have for the shop. But, I mean, come on, Marvel. You're going to try and screw people on the Amazing Spider-Man like that just because it's a special book. So, uh Again, it was a real quick video. I, I just wanted to get it out there to show the books off. Um, I do want to say thank you for all the positive reviews I got. Uh, I got a lot of good comments on the video I did yesterday and a couple of negatives, and that, that's natural. I mean, it's going to happen. No one's going to agree with everything that I say. Uh, so, again, I appreciate all the support. I appreciate the positive feedback. I get you know a lot of uh, good feedback from viewers from Canada, uh, over in England, Australia, uh, of course, all over the U.S., and it's greatly appreciated. So thank you so much for that. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. If you hadn't seen the video from yesterday, 
take a look at it. Um, I told you my goal is to reach 1,000 subscribers. I just think that's a good number to, to hit. Um, I'm going to keep doing these videos, but tonight I'm real tired. It's been a long day, but I want to get the video out there. So I know it was short. I hope you appreciate it. I hope you liked it. But if you didn't, as always, nothing I can do for you. Hope everybody has a great night.